Hello everyone, it's me again, GW Fan the Softcore Brony, welcome you back to Let's Play Cutie Mock Crusader Warriors. Onwards through the uh, teleporter. And I guess we're maybe this is like the top of the place or something, I don't know. Maybe there's like a mountain somewhere nearby, but yeah, we have the same enemy, not that I'm terribly concerned. Nice background, though. Oh, really, Scoot? You're, like, right there! What are you at? 71. Oh, my gosh. Really? Yeah, the other two aren't gonna level up before I get to the boss, but... Because, of course, there's gonna be one more boss. Alrighty, plus three speed to Scootaloo. <laughs> yeah, 154. So I would have gotten to 151 anyway, even if I hadn't given her those haste crystals back there. So, nice, nice. Did I get any more crystals in those two battles? And there's nothing to the left or the right. They're just blank spots. Well, if I didn't, I did just now. As we get to this area that does not have any random encounters in it. And yeah, I did get couple little things there. Let's actually show off my stats this time, since I kind of forgot to last time, even after I said it. So, yeah, defense is looking awesome there. I kind of wish I had more physical defense, but that's okay. Yeah, and speed, of course. Yeah, 140, 120, looking pretty good there, and 238 magic compared to 219 attack on Scootaloo, although it does scale so much more. And then, of course, the 154 speed, which is nice. So, and then her... Luck keeps up just fine with the other two, as is, so. Anyway, we have, uh, you again, and also a weird tree that's apparently painted onto the grounds or something. I don't know, but, yeah, there's, there's that. Can't we just take this? I mean, it's right there, but, no, we have to talk to him. Doesn't matter what side we talked to him for once this time. Although I would like to go ahead and say, just in case something screwy happens. You never know. And he does dance back and forth, and I can see your face behind you. Look at that, man. You're too far to the right. <laughs> I was not expecting that. That was a total mistake on my part. I'm glad I found it. <laughs> uh. Oh, yeah? Well, you seem to be dancing, but... Uh, nah, she's just... She's good, but she's not as good as that other kid. <laughs> Step away from the world stone, jerk! It's like, right, right, that old line again. Actually, it's to his side now, but, I mean, we could just walk behind him since he wasn't going to do anything to stop us while we were playing around in the tree, but... Yeah. We don't have watches, and we're too young to know how to tell the time by the sun. And another thing. Oh man, again? That is kind of a scary power when you think about it. I mean, that's how we destroyed Emerald, isn't it? But anyway, we got, uh, yeah, I guess he gets away with the world stone, unfortunately. But yeah, we have a bigger problem. In the form of D.Va! And this boss actually hits really, really dang hard, and is also pretty fast as well. I'm actually going to want to do uh, slow raw right from the get-go. <laughs> and... When I said that all the Wind Guardians are affected by sleep, I meant literally every last one of them, including this guy. Although he is somewhat more resistant to it than other bosses, or at least I have a harder time getting it to stick on him. Do I want to do bravery? Nah, let's not bother. It's not going to be that big of a deal. Oh, actually, maybe it will be. Yeah, he can hit like a freaking truck at times. So I, just in case 
Sleep misses, I do want to get uh, D-Brave. Because, yeah, he can do some really nasty physical attacks that I probably won't end up showing now <laughs> because I said all that. But anyway, he doesn't... I don't think he has any particular weakness. At least, not that I've seen. But there's that. Oh, actually, he might be slightly weak to lightning. Okay, cool. Glad I know that now. Yeah, I definitely want to get that double D brave on you. Or, no, no, no. I want to put you back to sleep. I would prefer not to deal with your nasty attacks if I can help it. Nope. Oh, okay, here we go. Good thing I got D brave on him twice, though, because otherwise that would really hurt. Oh, really? He only attacked once? That counted as attacking once. <laughs> but, uh, let's see here. Double depraved. I can stun. He doesn't take a whole lot of damage from Holy, unfortunately, but it's something. So, we're gonna go for that. Thanks for going before Apple Bloom. I... Apparently, that's not working out quite so well. There we go, that's more like it. And I'm gonna wanna put him, I'm gonna wanna slow him down again, I think, this turn. So, let's just get a regular slow. And then I'll want to get another deep rave next turn. And you are asleep, right? Yes, you are, okay. Yeah, let's go ahead and do Thundaga then. That does seem to do a little bit more damage than the other ones. And just keep hitting away, Scoot. Swing away. Stays there, get that gray just in case again. And, oh, no, no, I want to put you back to sleep. You did wake up, right? Every once in a while they don't, but yeah, he did this time. Yeah, I want to make sure he can't do anything too mean if he that ever misses, which, like, now. Oh, okay, fine. Well, you're probably not going to do much to me at this point, so. Yeah, we pretty much have you after this turn, so... Regardless of whether or not I put you to sleep. Let's see you do something mean. There we go. That's mean. Not that mean, though, since I got him uh, weakened so heavily, but... And since he slowed down so much, he's dead, so that wasn't too bad. He's a little harder than the other bosses on the continent, but not that much. Yeah, he does seem to be a little bit more resistant to sleep than the other... Oh, wow. He survived. Oh, right, because Dia's not doing, like, 6,000 damage this time. Okay. <laughs> well, even if it wasn't, I would have been, like, 600 points short, but... Well, that wasn't much, dude. <laughs> well, he still was a chomp since he didn't do anything that turn, but... Yeah, he can hit the whole party, like, multiple times. <laughs> Yeah, all of them multiple times, so... Yeah, there's that, but... Okay, not bad, not bad. Apple pie, muffins. More money that I... I don't know, maybe I'll buy some hay or something in the near future. Yeah, that's done. Gotta get out of here, though. And I do have to walk out, but on the way out... Uh, it's not exactly in event, but there's sort of an event that occurs once I think we get down to the teleporter down here, if I'm not mistaken. Hmm, we're already getting some nice crystals. Oh, yeah. There... Oh, I, never mind. There is an event. Okay, this is what triggers that other event that I was thinking of. Okay, never mind. I forgot you're here. Again. Although, this one we can't skip, unlike the last far site. Yeah, we kind of sucked that time. We just kind of let him get away. Does she mean out of hoof? I distinctly remember Rainbow Dash saying, What are hands? You know, besides a measurement in the world of ponies. Oh, well, that isn't that nice. Yeah, we need to get the last one in Diamond, which is the home of the Star Ponies. Wow. So yeah, how do we get there? Is it the last continent that we haven't been to yet? Oh, it's not? Well, dang. 
Oh, really? Sacred key, huh? And where would that be? In Amethyst. And that is the ice continent to the uh, northeast. Uh, hey, we weren't done talking! Oh well. Behind what? I was, I didn't entirely catch that. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he got all the other ones, but... Surely he won't get this one. But first, a new power awakens! The power of the samurai! And the chapter six, the tower to the heavens. Guess why it's called that? <laughs> Duh. Anyway, uh, well, let's see. Let's go ahead and do those crystals first. Uh, okay, you two need that. Fine, you could use it. Oh, and that's for Scootaloo, and I think you're, it's your turn. So, anyway, we've got a new... Yeah, new uh, kitty mark there in the Samurai! Or, Samurai, excuse me. Wait, is that spelled right? Isn't it S-A-M-U-R-A-I? Huh. Maybe I'm not remembering that correctly, but anyway, we have the Samurai class. Which, uh, is actually decent, I suppose. It's certainly better than the Dark Knight. <laughs> Samurai basically is, well, it's kind of like the Paladin and the Berserker, in a way, as it's sort of a glass cannon, because it's, well, its HP is more like a mage, as it only gets, like, plus 9 and occasionally plus 10, and its defenses are pretty bad, too, just not as bad as the Berserker, but they are really bad bad compared to other classes as you can see there but, but on the flip side though it does have some pretty insane speeds as it does start off uh, a little tiny bit faster than the paladin but it's minimum speed growth is plus three occasionally getting plus four so it is pretty wickedly fast unfortunately its attack power doesn't isn't really all that high either so it's more dependent on its actual skills, which, as far as I've seen at least, are entirely TP-based, which is not the worst thing in the world with this one, because it does learn a skill that raises your TP by 20 points without sapping your TP otherwise, even though it technically is supposed to cost 10. But yeah, you just need that much to use it in the first place. But even so, it's not that good, since all of its offensive abilities, besides its uh, first one costs more than 30. I think that like it costs the next one costs 50 in fact <laughs> So you're gonna be charging up a lot just to use these stronger attacks mostly except the uh, again the First ability you get which only costs 10 points and it ignores defense otherwise which isn't really that great <laughs> as I've demonstrated a few times I think so I mean, just because of how low enemies' defenses tend to be, since they don't really grow much. I mean, it can be useful here and there, and you do a little bit more damage, but I don't really find it to be that great <laughs> or significant, and especially at this point when I'm already at level freaking 36 and I pallet in there, so... Yeah, it's better than the Berserker in my opinion, but not as good as the Paladin. Probably not as good as the Spellblade either, honestly, even though it is technically faster. Uh, since the Spellblade doesn't have the kind of speed growth that the Samurai or Paladin does, but Spellblade at least gets a little bit stronger. <laughs> so yeah, I'm not going to use the Samurai, but it's there. So I'm going to have to walk out of here once again, and uh, well, we can go to Amethyst, which I'll show you real quick. Yeah, I only needed like two battles to level up, so I figured I might as well since they were so close. And Apple learns the Holy Spell, which isn't really that great, unfortunately, but <laughs> there it is. And yeah, Sweetie Belle gets another level with learning nothing else, but that's okay. She still gets more magic. More haste for Scootaloo, why not? 
there you go, Scoot. Defense, or not defense, the speed's looking decent there. And we get the Holy Spell, which is, well, an offensive Holy Elemental. But it costs TP, actually I think it costs TP and MP or something like that. But I'm not sure exactly how much MP <laughs> if it does, but uh, since I practically never use this on account of how much TP it costs, so... Anyway, that's there, and I'll you know, almost certainly never use it. But, anyway, we can go to Amethyst. And, in fact, I am going to want to stop off there real quick to buy a few things. Uh, for purposes that I'll be explaining momentarily. And, let's see, I believe... Uh, let's see, it is kind of like right over there, right? Ah, uh, yes, right below me. Okay. Oh, that reminds me. We can actually move while we're on this screen with the map here <laughs> and walk into towns and all kinds of things. I just moved just now. So, yeah, I'm over the ocean now. <laughs> I was just right over here. So, yeah, you can move <laughs> while you're on that screen if you want, although you can still get into random encounters, which will fortunately supersede the map there. So, anyway, we got the ice continent over here, which actually is fairly expansive. I think the purpose is that we're supposed to land over here in the grass and then uh well we can come up here to the town and this is where we want to go but since we can land on snow it doesn't really matter i don't know if that was intentional or not but anyway this is the town of amethyst this is just the inn and the that building up there i'm not actually going to go to the inn here i want to go up to this place which i could have gone to forever ago but i didn't really have a reason to. This just has convenient stuff to buy that I know of, so let's see. Do I want to get more oats? Or hay, I mean? Yeah, I'm probably good. Let's see, zap apples, I don't really need. I'm gonna go ahead and buy five more, though, just because. And refreshers, also, I want to buy uh, some more of these for purposes very very soon or basically next time because even though we could go to the what was that place over there wherever the key is <laughs> in that place right over there if you want to go here next you can but that's not what i'm going to be doing let's see i think i want to go this way if i'm not mistaken because now is the time that we can get full access to some certain side quests Oh, actually, I think it's right... Oh, wait, never mind. I think we're right by... Hold on. We are right by the... Oh, yeah, we are right by there. Okay, hang on. I actually want to go back this way. I want to go back to the first town in the game, which should be, like, right over here-ish. If I go, let's see, down here to the bottom, and this way, I should hit that. Because uh, we could have already come back to... Okay, there it is. Yeah, for example, this cave and also gone to a couple of other places, except for, I think, the volcano. Apparently, the optional boss there doesn't appear until now for some reason, or so I've heard anyway. I didn't actually check on my own. So, fortunately, the extinction event happened a while ago, so this place is totally devoid of enemies. So, it's a perfect time to come here to do some dragon slaying next time on Let's Play Cutie My Crusader Warriors. Fully optional, but I'm going to do it because it is totally possible now. Arrivederci.